Thanks for joining the Family Puppy team. We have created an employee handbook so that if there's any questions, you actually have somewhere that you could refer back to. When we hire you on, we do expect you to read and understand everything in this handbook. You will be given the book to review um, while you're here. And then also, you will be given a handbook acknowledgement form that you will sign and date, acknowledging that you have read it and understand it and have had all your questions answered. There also may be a quiz that you will be given in order to make sure that everything has been reviewed and that there's no complications or questions about anything that's in the handbook. It's all pretty self-explanatory. talks about how to be a professional member of our team and make sure that everything is explained to you in pretty in-depth in here. So take advantage of it. It's a great resource for you and you will have it available to you to refer back to. It'll be located in the store. Ask your manager for its location so that if you ever have any questions, you'll be able to find it. In your employee handbook, you will find all kinds of useful information. There's some things that are um, a little bit that I want to touch on today, uh, just to make sure that we talk about some of the key points of the handbook. Everything in here is important, that's why we put it in a handbook for you. But some of the key things that we're going to talk about today is customer service and what makes us different. And the handbook's first four pages are really key to getting an idea for what the atmosphere should be like in our store. You should always have a smile on, of course, making sure that you're being as professional as possible. It tells you how to open and close a phone call, make sure that you give the right information on the phone. It also talks about if you're allowed to take personal calls at work. Heads up, you're not, unless it's an emergency. Also, um, how to give the impression to be approachable. Talks about your um, the way that you are perceived and talks about how to be uh, answering questions for customers. There's just a lot of really good information in here um, to tell you how to have proper etiquette when it comes to customer service. So read through all of this, make sure that if there's any questions, you ask your manager about that. Another thing to remember is here at The Family Puppy, we are all part of a team. Uh, and the reason that we want you to remember that is because together, together everyone achieves more. That's what uh, TEAM stands for with us. So make sure that if you have any questions, you can ask your manager, uh, help out your coworkers, make sure that you always have a smile on your face, and uh, remember that you guys do work together for the good of those puppies. So in the handbook, a couple other things to talk about. The code of conduct is in there, making sure that you understand how to, again, give off the best professional appearance and make sure that we are not doing anything that's against the Family Puppy Code of Conduct. So read through that. It is page eight and nine. And then also personal appearance guidelines, and that goes along with the uniform, which we already discussed. Another page in here, this is a fun one to talk about. This is the Family Puppy Employee Benefits page. That is on page 12, and it's gonna discuss our discount program and uh, what you guys are eligible for and when. And then it also talks about um, supplies and animals and the discounts that you're available for those. Um, and then in that same area, it talks about insurance. If you have any uh, questions or anything on that, that'll be in there as well. Um, page 14 talks about requested time off and sick days. And uh, if you need those kinds of things or special holidays or leave of absence, uh, that is discussed on page 14, so you can refer to that. So all of that stuff is available. One other thing that we want to talk about here too is payroll and um, deductions and earnings and overtime. That kind of stuff is discussed on page 19. It also talks about tardiness and absence, which of course uh, we don't tolerate. So make sure that you are reporting to work when you're supposed to be. It's important that we have everyone there when they are scheduled because we schedule you based on how many people we need on the floor at the time to make sure the puppies are well cared for and our, the, cu the customers are well cared for as well. So it discusses that as well. Uh, page 21 talks about performance appraisals and coaching. And uh, there's a lot of other good information in here as well. I just touched on a few things that I want to make sure that I stress is important to you. The handbook is full of good information and it is important that you do read through it completely. The things that I've touched on are some of the very important things that a lot of times come up later on, so that's why we touched on them today. You will have this handbook available to you. Make sure that you ask your manager where it's located and know about it, and if you have any questions about this, go ahead and ask your manager about it, and they'll be able to fill you in a little bit more detail if, if need be. Thanks again. Welcome to the Family Puppy. We're really glad you're a part of our team, and I look forward to meeting you very soon.